out for his 13th consecutive game with a family matter. The Warriors coming off a win on Monday night at home against the Phoenix Suns on the uh, teams that are in the play-in tournament. There's going to be a lot of games that you can point to, especially if you're forced to be in the play-in, if you're the Lakers. But let's just be honest. With this amount of two years, teams would just play inside the paint because we were running kind of a motion offense. And so what was your mentality when you found yourself that wide open? You know, it's interesting, guys. The Clippers, a lot of people thought they were a championship made team coming into the year. They went to the conference finals two years ago as Poole is fouled on the three by Jordan. Look, I've talked about being, you know, coached by T. Lou, and he is an ultimate chess player. You give him enough pieces over the course of a playoff series. I totally agree, and I think the addition of Eric Gordon gives them more vis versatility in shooting on the wing. Kawhi and Paul George have only played in 35 games together. Tonight's their 36th game, so roughly half their season, one of or two of those guys have been out of the lineup. And Leonard rips the ball away from Curry. That's six boards for Leonard. And now Kawhi fouled on the drive. Fifth of the quarter. Plumley couldn't handle the pass, though. Steph's got it now. Three on two. Curry looks, fires, good. Steph Curry. With 12 in the first. 10 points for Kawhi. Three seconds to go. Here's Poole behind the back. Pulls the trigger. Falling out of bounds. No good. A little bit more, you know, stiffness. Like they're going to be able to go. I'm surprised that Duke hasn't heard of that term. <laughs> Jordan Poole with the finish in transition. His first basket. By the way, Phoenix losing last night, so they're just a game up on the Clippers and the Warriors for that fourth spot in the West, which would mean home court in the first round. Poole, deep one is gone. Jordan Poole with his first three and the sixth for Golden State. Turnover, Poole, nice find, Green with the easy put down in transition, 10 straight for Golden State. Bodies, arms, and legs to get it through, you gotta be good. Seven unanswered for the Clippers, a whistle and a foul as Poole goes to the rim time now for drive to the hoop. It's that same concept, where if you can catch it in that short roll and then make a play out of it, you can often get a layup. From fourth to tenth, just three games separate. Well, let's just acknowledge that every game is enormous right now for all these teams. We have an over-under on the amount of podcast references that we're going to get today. <laughs> Here's George lining it up. No good. George with 10 points. Leonard has 11 to pace the Clippers. Steph Curry with 12, the top Golden State so far. Poole slips and falls. And another Warrior turnover, their seventh. Here's Plumley in transition. He's been at the dunker. He's thrown plays out in transition. And now at seven foot, 300 pounds, he's out leading the break. Thompson hits. Play Thompson's first two point basket. Just don't look at offense and stiffness as going together in a positive way. Here's a steal by Curry. And he got it to George somehow. I think George actually deflected it, but it still got to pull for the layup and 37 minutes a game over his last 24. Five 30-point games in his last nine, including 44 in that shootout with the Kings as a jump ball is called here between Poole and Kawhi Leonard. He sets it all up with his handle. I mean, he's got one of the best handles in the NBA. I, I think for a young player that has so much in front of him and so much asked of him, I think he made some mistakes. I think he understands that, and he's doing everything he can. Still a four despite the great performance here in the quarter by Curry. Eric Gordon from deep, no. Curry quickly ahead to pull. It's a cutting green in transition for the jam. Spinning, leaning, Kaminga. Three seconds to shoot, Poole, good! A three for Poole that gets the Warriors within three. Played 29 minutes, that's something you guys touched on at the top of the telecast. Here's Poole, no good. And out of bounds. Tonight, and they move and they pass. I think the Clippers have done a great job of being physical and being into their airspace. They're moving past Allen Iverson in the ninth all time, but the Warriors have Brought in many of their reserves as Poole hits a three. Ten-point game, minute 13 to go. And some of that wing defense, you're talking about two elite defenders that could help out, especially with Andre Iguodala out now with a fractured wrist. I appreciate the accountability, J.D. <laughs> That's what it's about. Yeah. Here's Poole in the lane, lost the ball. 16 turnovers 
for Golden State. Here's Plumley, and he'll pull it out. Excellent win for the Clippers tonight. 134-126 over the Warriors.